fine chap has just asked me to sign, thankfully not a human head, no, but yeah, a fake human head, so I can't just go sign it. Always a good idea to bring fizzy drinks with you when you're eating a lot. Helps the, uh, the old digestion process. Plenty of spare underwear in here. Usually go with the budget ones when Mrs. Biz isn't here. She likes the pricier options. Corridors like this remind me of that movie The Shining. I see a little girl turn that corner at the end, riding the tricycle. Ugh. A little desk here. It's early morning, I'm well rested. We're well, not well rested. You never really get a great night's sleep on a full belly. Still, could have been worse. Could have had Mrs. Beard snoring in my ear hole all night, which is usually the case. <laughs> anyway, we've got to pack up, check out, and uh, hit the road for Buckingham, which is the site of today's food challenge. You can still taste fish and chips though, so I hope it goes okay. place called Louis today and I'm taking on the 22 inches of pain challenge which I, I hope is a food challenge there's a funny story behind this because it started when the owner and some of the staff they shot a video and they said if anyone could finish their 22 inch giant pizza quicker than them then you could have the meal for free the kicker was neither the owner nor any of the staff could actually finish the pizza so now you just have to do it in 30 minutes and it's yours on the house Right, my place called Louis today. Louis Place or Louis Pizza? Just Louis. Louis Restaurant. I knew it was one of the four. <laughs> and I'm taking on their uh, their pizza challenge. 30 minutes to finish, right? Yeah, that's correct. And one person's done it before? Yeah. Standing up for this one. You gonna get serious? Starting now. I'm gonna fold this into like a big flipping. We're gonna make some big pizza sandwiches. What's up, Benami? Welcome back to another episode. Man, it feels good to be on the road doing lots of restaurant challenges again. And today we're at a place called Louis in Buckingham and we're taking on their 22 inches of pain challenge. Not sure who came up with the name. Sounds pretty terrifying. Fortunately, it's just a 22 inch pizza and uh, you get 30 minutes to finish, cost 30 quid. And uh, if you do it, if you manage to finish it all, it's on the house. Do you have any uh, napkins, mate? <laughs> Thanks, buddy, cheers. <clears throat> I suppose I should probably show you the size of one of the slices. They're pretty big. How's it going, man? Are you the owner? Um, yeah. I recognize you from the You didn't manage to finish this, did you? Oh, <laughs> Not the one embarrassing on film. You gave a good shot, though. I think out of everyone on the film, you were uh, yeah, you I were close dead. Tasting just before, so I, uh, that's the excuse. Yeah, I'm just going to have a lot of cocktail. Yeah, I mean, I'm not entirely sure that a cocktail tasting marathon is the best prep when trying to finish a pizza quite this big. But that was the uh, the owner who actually he did all right on the video I saw when they launched the challenge. He, he gave it a pretty good attempt. Ooh. This is delicious pizza. Mm. Yeah, you can tell it's good. Listen to the sound effects, you hear that? Mmm! <laughs> uh, but the, the only rule, other than the fact that you have to finish it in 30 minutes, is you have to choose a pizza with at least one meat topping. And I went with the Pitmaster, because I thought it sounded pretty interesting. You get pulled pork, red onions, and, and barbecue sauce on top. It's delicious, man. It's really nice. Yeah, I mean, I, I hesitate to say it was the best pizza I've ever eaten, but it's, it's got to be top five. This was a really rich pizza, crisp on the outside, but nice and soft and easy to eat. All right, I think I can relax a little bit now. Yeah, I've got most of the hard work out of the way at this point. I was a little worried when they brought the pizza out because I had done the Anchor Fish and Chip Challenge the day before this, and that was pretty starchy, so it was sitting pretty heavy. <laughs> there you go, there, there's your proof. That's the, the Anchor Fish and Chip Challenge almost on the way out. <laughs> Fortunately, the, the, the restaurant was not particularly highly populated at that point in time, so <laughs> nobody heard that. At least I think nobody heard it. 
These are my kind of napkins. These are some like premium posh napkins. Like that triple ply, perfect for a man who gets food in his beard a lot. I was doing this fish and chip challenge and, uh, and I remembered that somebody had messaged me and asked me to come and do this one. I think the owner here was just asking me what I was doing at this place. The only person that's done it in 28 minutes. 28 minutes. That is not half bad because uh, this pizza, although it tastes delicious, it's no joke. So if you're watching, hats off to you. I came down for three slices. <laughs> three slices? Yeah. They're a pretty big guy as well. To be fair, I don't blame him, they are massive. I mean, the guy, he was a good, like, six feet, maybe six two, something like that. So I would have thought maybe you could push it to at least at least four slices. <laughs> no, I'm joking. This is a, is a monster pizza. And I would highly recommend it. If you're into pizza, who's not into pizza? It's a daft thing to say. If you like your pizza and uh, you're in the area, or even if you're not in the area, it's probably worth traveling for. I mean, I travel like 200 miles for it. <laughs> but yeah, it's great pizza. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you in the next one. Right. Is that good? Yeah. Hold well on, buddy. <laughs> Thank you. I don't know if you want to do that, but that's all right. <laughs> 1731 it was. That's not bad. Got a real urge to just kind of hoy this like Captain America. <laughs> Pardon me. I do want to say, impressive beard. I don't know why I like yours, yours is pretty cool. I like the little bits of grey in there. It gives it some don't worry, it comes in time. Yeah. <laughs>